You're on True and welcome to another exciting day in our galaxy. And as promised, I want to give you some introduction in the preview of the subspace transmission. That's the Xbox faction expansion that's coming tonight. I talked about the update 62, the Enterprise Part 1 again, and I said that I will make a separate video about the Xbox because um, it's a little bit more stuff to talk about and so I, I want to have it separate and that's what I'm doing now. But before I get started with it, if you're not a subscriber of my channel yet but do like my videos, please do subscribe to my channel and then also click this little bell and all notifications so you will know when a new video is out. Like today it's a bit more because of all the changes. As I said, they announced the Enterprise arc now and as part of it, uh, extension of the Xbox faction and that also brings a new race and that's the Zindi. And uh, there will be five new reputation levels with the Xbox, 25 new Xbox favors, you know those from the Bajorans and the Section 31. And there will be new systems, that's the Delphic Expense. The Zindi and the Delphic Expense, you will remember, that was the space where the Enterprise went after the Zindi attacked Earth with their test weapon. and you will have to fight Zindi now. And um, if you want to do this, there are some prerequisites. First of all, this applies to people level 40 and higher. And if you're level 40 and higher, and if you have 22,500 uh, 22, Xbox faction reputation, that is not max any longer, that's now distinguished with the Xbox, then you can get to the Zindi. To do this, you get uh, you need to get the favor particle beam delay, and that can be obtained using Xbox credits in the Xbox store. And after you got this particle beam delay, you can fly to the new Delphic expense systems and begin to fight two new hostiles there. The one is the Zindi Reptilian warships. The Zindi Reptilians were the one behind the the. Um, latest attack on Earth with, with a finished weapon and they are wanted Zindi Reptilian warships and they both give um, a certain new loot. The, they all drop Zindi scraps and those you can use in the um, new reputation and Xbox credit bundle and the wanted Zindi Reptilian warships also drop Zindi bounties and that can be turned in for more rewards then. As I said, there are new reputation ranks and that is now distinguished, celebrated, esteemed, venerated, exalted and liberator from 22,500 reputation up to 260,000. Many of you that are, or I guess everyone that's level 40 will be at the max level um, until tonight. But tonight uh, it will not be max anymore and you have to start getting reputation again. And there will be new Xbox bundles. There will be loot exchanges um, for Zindi scrap and Zindi bounties. And that can be exchanged for reputation and new Xbox credits. Because the credits are changed as well now. There will be uncommon, rare and epic uh, credits now. That's more like in other factions or um, stuff like this, but but uh, before you only had one sort of Xbox credit and now there will be three. The uncommon uh, credits can be used to upgrade the favors or trade it in for material ship parts or the material needed to power a variety of active ship abilities. That's a bit like with the Bajorans. So there will be a material exchange, a ship parts exchange and ship ability fuel. And the rare credits can be used to upgrade the new Xbox favors or used for artifact shards for faction reputation and credits or shards of the Voyager officers. And the reputation fa uh, faction reputation stuff I never liked in um, other, other shops, but um, that you can get have another source for faction credits could be really nice. And uh, so we will... I will look forward to it to have a look how much and how expensive. In section 31, the reputation is just far too expensive. And there will be epic credits. 
you can use them also for the favors or stuff you need to level and tear up forbidden tech for some exclusive cosmetics so maybe we will find the ball cube refit there but we will see or op specific bundles that provide a variety of materials for progression so there's a forbidden tech exchange a style exchange a g4 g5 and g6 mega chest i guess that depends on your level as well and there are also three bundles for high rarity credits and exchange them for lower rarity if you let's say you have epic credits like hell but you need um, rare credits and then you can just exchange them so it's the uncommon trade down the rare trade down and the epic trade down and as i said there will be these favors as you know them from from the bajorans and from um, the section 31 they did that now too and uh, you have those favors here with the x -Borg then as well. They weren't there before, but now there will be. And there will be 25 x -Borg favors and um, with uh, different um, benefits. I see there's a Mo Monovine Barrage Amplifier. There's a Galaxy Plundering. There's Defensive Repair. There's Interceptor Emergency Protocol. Interceptor parts, Borg Armada spoils, Zindi escalation, critical damage floor. That's the one um, I talked about in the other video and so on. So we will see how much I, I like them. The critical floor um, I talked about in my last video already is um, that your critical damage will never be lower than your maximum normal damage. And uh, so it might be a little bit helpful. But um, there's a whole list of those. I, I gave you some examples, so I will not read out that list. But um, it means there's a lot of new stuff to come. But in this case, they didn't accept the systems, the new systems they're introducing. It's like what they did uh, earlier. First, they put in Borg systems, then the Ferengi they never cared about again. Um, then um, Cardassian Space, um, Dominion the Delta Quadrant, and at some point they, they, they will put in now the, the Zindi there when when you um, have the favor you need to, to go there. and um, But everything else is just an extension of something existing. And I'm, I hope that they might get away with a little less bucks than usual, but we will see tonight um, how many bucks are awaiting us. But um, they didn't throw in too much n brand new stuff. So the favors we know from two other factions, the Zindi, yeah, remind me a little bit of what they did when they um, introduced the Monovine systems with the Texas class. So I hope they are building on existing programming here and uh, didn't mess up too much, but it's a new arc. Last time was the worst one I ever experienced with the bugs and the days it took to, to repair all of this, but um, tonight we will know. But I'm looking forward to this because there are some things in, in the Xbox expansion that sound really um, interesting and really helpful, but it will depend how it will be really look in action. So um, we will see tonight how that all works. And uh, of course, this these last two videos were just a preview of what's coming uh, with the information I got like everyone else. Um, unfortunately, there's no kind of a press team or whatever that gives me, um, at least I know of, that gives me some earlier information um, for those videos. So I can only work with what you also get. But uh, I think a lot of you don't want to read that much. And so I always do these videos to, to put it in a video so you don't have to read it yourself um, before you get the whole, uh, whole thing activated. And... Um, Especially for my German viewers now, I'm doing uh, German videos as well on, on Outside Views STFC uh, Deutsch. That means German. Um, so I only find these texts every time in English. So for, for some of them, it will be more helpful even, I guess, because um, 
there are not so many anymore, but uh, still a few people that don't speak English, and so <laughs> that might be helpful. But if you want to add something about the the announcement Scopely made now about the new stuff, let me know. Put a put it in the comments under this video. I'm quite excited to know what you think about this. And if you have questions or video requests, of course, do the same. And if you just want to say hi and where you're from, you know, I'm always happy to read your comments. And if you want to see another video right now, and while we wait for the next arc to start, the next video is right here in the end screen. I'll see you there. I'll be back.